So this one just, you know, it made me kind of smile and laugh, but also irritated me a little bit. So there's an article on one of the news services that I use for a lot of my research talking about Shiba Inu and how the community was being slammed by, I guess, other parts of the community for, quote, too little community burns, end quote. And I was like, that really makes no sense because here's the deal. The community burns are completely voluntary, right? It means like you and I as retail, uh, you know, uh, retail investors in Shiba Inu, it's up to us to voluntarily burn those tokens. Of course, it's voluntary. And then there's the other side of the of the street, which is the the burns that are coming from you know the community um, excuse me from the from Shiba Inu the the project itself like the deflationary burns that are going to be built into Shibarium at least that's what we're hearing right where there's going to be every single transaction that runs through Shibarium which is Shiba Inu's layer 2 blockchain that's coming will have every single transaction there'll be a little piece cut out of that each transaction and spun off and then sent to the burn wallet right that's a community excuse me that's a a burn initiative coming from the project burns associated with you know Shiba turned into the game probably burns will be built into the metaverse all that kind of stuff that's the project oriented burns that come from the project themselves Shiba Inu the corporate burns if you will those are what are going to really make a difference let's just call it what it is we're hearing you know um, projections that a hundred trillion, Shiba Inu tokens can maybe be burned when everything in the ecosystem is up and running. Metaverse, game, uh, game's already out, obviously, um, and Shibarium, all that's up and running and future projects, 100 trillion. The community burns being completely 100% voluntary will always be small relative to the overall supply, but it all does aggregate and add up over time. And so anytime I see somebody or a group of people slamming somebody associated with the Shiba Inu community for something that is completely voluntary it might it, it kind of makes me go what well why are you, what you know why are you saying that why are you doing that it's completely up to me you the the million plus holders whether we want to burn some or not I have sent stuff to my burn the burn wallet I didn't really announce it I just did it but my point to you is again this goes back to this narrative of like why do we have People attacking, you know, various components of, you know, of, of, of the Shiba Inu ecosystem. That's what I got for you. Final, final note. Down in the description below, there's a link to a company called Tradix. And they are the, um, the new channel sponsor for me for the month of January. Check them out. It's a really cool trading platform that's going to kind of tr change the way you um, you you trade with DeFi on the DeFi side. It's it's a really cool app that's going to be coming out on the 9th of January. That's going to give you the ability to set you know to, uh, to 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 set stop losses and things like that. Really cool stuff associated with kind of DeFi trading, not on the centralized exchanges. So check that out. Links in the description below. I'll see you. Have a good one. Bye.